So we're going to talk about water chemistry. It's very, very important that you produce the right amount of chlorine for your pool. If you produce too much chlorine, it's very unhealthy for your family and yourself. And it also can damage the liner, can damage important components of your equipment, and it can also damage your solar liner. So the way that we test the water chemistry, and mainly what we're testing for is chlorine, is we use these test strips. After testing the pool, look in the back of your test strip. You want to match the color coded, which is on labeled on the back. So pool OK is between one and three parts per million. So you want to see slight pink to purplish. If it goes dark purple, you've got way too much and you need to turn your chlorinator down. If it's too light in the beige and there's not enough chlorine, you need to turn it up a little bit. When you turn up your chlorinator or you turn it down, you have less or more buttons that are on the salt chlorine generator. So all you have to do is press the less button to go down 20% or press the more button to go up 20%. change the salt chlorine generator because it's such a large body of water it takes time you can't change it and expect to see a difference in an hour so you always give it a day or two and then you can retest and make the change again if 